WFMU is where you are tuned, and you are here on the Music Faucet with Irene Trudell being the host and the engineer tonight. My guests in the studio will be Cryptic Soup. We're going to hear something from a brand new album that they've just done, a couple little things, and uh, then we'll have them back in the studio live here. Here is Private Parade.
tracks from Cryptic Soup, plus some of our sound check. <laughs> yes, Irene screwed up here, and hopefully we had some, we had no naughty words going over, but <laughs> I'm not sure. Again. Yeah, we need the sound check again. That's what we get. We're too busy eating food and having fun in the other room. And, oh, that's what I get for engineering and doing everything at once. I've said that before, but it's okay. WFMU is where you are tuned, and we heard a couple of tracks from a new album by Cryptic Soup, Salty Pretzel Dog Logic, we heard Private Parade, Torture, and a Victim of You. And we have all these folks here, live in the studio. Do you hear me out there? Now you hear me. A little. Me. Now you hear me. We Not really. Hear we can hear you. You hear me a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, there we go. Hi, Irene. Hi. Hi, Phil. <laughs> assisted by Phil Levy tonight and many other friends in the studio we have Cryptic Soup and they're going to play it live for us right now
you get that scar? Straight across your neck. Only one song and you're tired? Oh, oh my goodness. It's late. We can't have this happening. I'm in my 30s. <laughs> Open the sprint. All right. Okay. Um, this next one we're going to do is also new. It's not off our CD. It's, uh, it's a song called uh, Shovel. Shovel the Dirt. All right. Shovel the 
down to. <laughs> We're here in the studio with Cryptic Soup. We have Vinnie and Eddie Sino on guitars and drums, respectively. John Rosenblatt on the other guitar. The, <laughs> the other guitar. The air conditioning went out again. <laughs> Kathy Roop on keyboards and Ed Grisak on the bass. Ed Wood. Ed Wood, yes. <sighs> Ed Wood, what are we doing? Ed Wood, if he could. <laughs> but he can't, so he won't. <laughs> this is Thorn. Another one, not on the side we're trying to sell. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> we'll talk to you about that in a little while. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Like an addict to his grasp in his drugs Scratch by a thorn on the rose I never knew it was Touch me, I don't ask for much I can't stand waiting, it lacks the salt Scratch by a thorn on the rose I surrender my fault Blood on the knuckles I stumble the prayer Thank you very much. We've got another one for you. <laughs> what are we going to do? Mm. Go We're all alone, so we don't know what to do. So what we'll do We're is... We're the band, so... We've announced the band, right? Yeah, we did. Oh, okay, so uh, anyway... Soap. Anyway, those last couple we did are not from the CD. Do you want to do Lost? Uh, I guess we could do Lost. So if you want to do them? Okay. Um, so... This is yet another one, is it not? You want to do uh, another one from the CD? No, let's do one from the CD. Okay, let's do... Uh, <laughs> we have so many songs to do, we don't know what to do. Someone throw one out. How about uh, Dead Men? Uh, radio land. Nail in a set list. the whole idea. <laughs> <laughs> what is that I against the wall it. there? <laughs> there is one. It's made up. I see one. Someone hung one I on see the something against oh, the yeah. wall there. What are you getting ready the duck to play? Next to the, the psychedelic the goose at everyone. I can't play without the duck. Oh. Oh. Don't, no, don't do disconnect. Don't you blow. Oh. Oh. Um, <laughs> I see what Let's do Cupid. Torture. Torture. All right. We did that already. They played that one already. That's all right. We this is a live yeah, you heard the studio version. Such organization, my goodness. Live. 
Soup here on WFMU Uppsala College, East Orange, New Jersey. How are you doing in there? All right. We're doing okay. It's hot. It's now that I'll one bet it's very is hot from the CD, in fact, and we know it for sure because we heard it on the radio. On the radio, on the radio. yes, I did. Uh, on the CD. I will tell people that Cryptic Soup does have this new album. It's called Salty Pretzel Dog Logic, and how might one person get a copy uh, of that's this? That's a good question. Um, you can actually go see... Fine gentleman named Bruce at Downtown Music Gallery Very on cool East 5th Street store. between 2nd and 3rd Avenue. That's if you're hanging around in the Lower East Side. Or, or, or if you're down around the World Financial Center, stop in to Downtown Sound because they've got copies all of, also. And, That's uh, our number one sales rep, John Rosenblatt. <laughs> <laughs> Do I know where this, this CD district. is or what? Racking up those sales. And if you happen to be walking around on St. Mark's Place which now, John usually is. which I do something, <laughs> stop into Sounds. And Stay ask them for it, it, because they won't carry it unless we get people to go in there and ask uh-huh. for it. So Word of mouth. Go on in and hound them. Do and our then, dirty work for yeah. us. So That's Downtown nice. Music Gallery, Downtown Sound, and Sounds. Right, so all the words are connected. Downtown right. and Sounds, that's the words. That's right. <laughs> Keywords. This is Cupid Scalling House. From the CD, as you can get in all those places. <laughs> On the roof I didn't Not on the roof I didn't This devil dodger Wants to drive my soul to the news Golden house Says he could teach me a lesson On how I should share an embrace Is it my legs or the streets That is shaking Yeah. 
I ever asked you how long have you guys been together? I know it's been several years since I've gotten to know you, but uh, um, we want to admit this. Um, it's almost going to be ten years this December. Wow! You and Ed have been together your whole life. Well, that's different. In different, different names, different personnel, but essentially soup. Essentially soup. Very cryptic. <laughs> Very mixed up. No, they're not. <laughs> I'm so confused. What are we doing? We're going to do a new song uh, for you, Irene. Uh, a new lost. song for me. Another called one. Lost. You okay <laughs>
That's a loss. Lost? Yeah, no, you don't sound lost. I sound we more lost, lost to you. <laughs> I finally found it. You finally found it. Hey, seeing as how this, uh, this CD of yours that you just put out um, is out sort of on your own, did you find that really hard to put together? Extremely. Even trying to get money out of Rosenblatt. It was unbelievable. <laughs> that was the most difficult <laughs> challenge of the whole project. <laughs> yeah, it was very tough. I mean, we, we only worked like maybe, I'd say, a An month out of a year. I mean, at maybe least a, a month, month and a half maybe out, a of, month. out of a year. It took like, time. like four years to do it. But if you add up all the time or something together, it's like, like maybe just a regular a month. A month. A month. Well, of having to time. fit it in between your day jobs and all that stuff. Right. That well, yeah, well, yeah. You know, well, we pay our engineer. You know. Yeah, we got to pay the engineer. Yeah. That's Shout, our buddy Don Stonecker, who helped us produce it. I was going to say, he's excellent. He's nameless. But yeah, cool. where is he? <laughs> hey, he should be here. I know. I know. Well, if, he, if he's listening, he should at least call and say hi. <laughs> or he's dead. <laughs> but you we all know him. Don has no radio at his studio, so. I know. Spinning the knobs. Spinning the knobs. <laughs> well, maybe he'll surprise us and call in. That would be great. This is called um, Caught in a Cobweb. It is? Oh. One, two, three. <laughs> Just like marshmallows But it seems to satisfy my mind My path to nowhere I just leave it behind me Did you ever drink with the spider On a Sunday afternoon Will I find myself Sleep on a hill, the sunshiny sky, all a thrill. I can't believe the way I behave. I hurl my youth into an early grave. Did you ever drink with the spider on a Sunday afternoon? Will I find myself? That's no wonder Ed is. <laughs> Ed kills those drums. I really have to say, you are one of the most powerful drummers I've ever met. He murders him. He murders the things. He's wanted in three so states. <laughs> <laughs> You're listening to Cryptic Soup here on WFMU, playing live on the Music Faucet. Uh, this is Irene filling in for Nick Hill. We will probably be back next week. 
Hi, Nick. Hi, Nick. Ed, what are you doing over here? I'm just wandering around. I'm going to walk In the spacious studios. Yeah, see, our wandering. spacious little <laughs> living room. We don't allow Eddie to have a mic, so he wanders by oh. our other mic. The edge is toward <laughs> our mics. <sighs> oh, he feels lonely over in that I corner. I want to say hello to uh, Nelson, who helped me uh, yes, drag you, our Nelson. stuff up here today, mm-hmm. up to here in New Jersey. Yes. Uh, how about Ruthie? And, and where is Ruthie? Ruth, I don't know. She's That's hiding out in the other room, and... Uh, Michael? Hi, Is Ruth. It? This one's called Dead Men. It has nothing to do with Ruth or Nelson, but it is. One, two, three, four. <laughs> some gigs can i Irene? please do okay <laughs> what if she said no <laughs> she said no <laughs> i said it was okay do tell where can one see cryptic what is this <laughs> okay we're going to be playing at a nice place uh i think it's, i believe it's on 30th street it 251 is 251 west 30th Downtown, street right? between i believe it's what six and seven? seventh and eighth seventh, seventh and eighth eight. avenue we're going to be playing there may 13th at 1 a.m. And it's called a nice place? It's a very nice place it's called no. Downtown. Downtown. Uh, it's downtown. Not, not to be confused with all those record stores. Downtown. With the yeah, downtown. Is this a theme? Down. <laughs> everything we're associated with is down, so don't look good for this band. <laughs> anyway, we're also going to be playing Saturday, June 11th at 8. We're changing that. Don't worry about that. 8 is sick. <laughs> Who we got said, this damn you gig? You said okay. Uh, I said okay with the date, not the time. That's all right. Well, we're going to be there anyway, so come. Same place, different... Same place, place. downtime. They're the only club that'll have us. Oh, 
Oh, that's not true. That's not true. Well, oh, for yeah. the next couple of months. Well, yeah, anybody case, that yeah. would like to have cryptic soup, please give a call. Yeah, please call. Call WFMU. Just a moment to. We're gonna we wanna, we're gonna give away some CDs later, so. Oh yeah. Yeah, we'll have some uh, trivia questions for you. Uh oh. Do you want to do one? So if you know them or not, you'll we get one. We can do one now if you want. Do one now. Ed, come over to Mike then. Come here, Ed. Hey, Ed. Hey, Ed. Hey, Ed. You right. got First the trivia question for the giveaway <laughs> of Salty Pretzel Dog Logic and this pressing of Salty Pretzel Dog Logic. Excuse me. Please come up to a mic. <clears throat> this pressing of Salty Pretzel Dog there. Logic yeah. also features the extended EP Roy Nathan's Duncan Hut. So, which will probably be left off all future pressings. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> so this Even is some of the present pressings item, don't have it on it. <laughs> so you've got to be really quick to get it. Uh, this trivia question, <laughs> who played bass on the majority, that's most of the songs, on Sly and the Family Stone Fresh album? Okay. So, I mean, I mean, to give the oh, play a song. A and I'll take the phone. I'll take the names. All you need to do is call in here to the studio in the 201 area code 678-7743. Call us here at WFMU, and we'll give you a CD if you can answer that question. What's next? What's next? Endless. Oh. I hear the sirens whine Through the sounds of my drain pipes and the music of Miles Davis The windows bowed to shatter But all I have is a great big yawn As you can see, it only bores me I think I'm in need of a change Someone help me take hold of my ring It's My bottle of sangria Takes control over my tongue And it brings up dirty laundry Talking to the walls I somehow get sidetracked By a glimpse of you in a photograph I think I'm in need of a change
Arctic Sioux. One of my favorite songs from the new CD. You actually played that last time you were out here visiting. Which yeah, was I think it was the first time we ever played it, too. Maybe. I don't know. That was yeah. right. The guy was right. Well, Chris Rad is the winner. He wins a CD. Oh, great. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'll take all the pertinent information on that. <laughs> We have live here in the studio Cryptic Soup playing for you on the music faucet. What do you mean? Strangers? Yeah, why not? I don't know. Actually, it would have been learned for this record. We, we didn't learn it for it, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good reason. We would have put it on there, it, but we so didn't put it So we learned it. We learned it like... See, said, that's oh, what happens. Forgot about this. Well, you're forgiven. You guys write so many songs. Yeah. I understand that there are tons and tons of songs out there that have not made it to regular studio tapes. 428. <laughs> <laughs> Last count. Yeah, 428.5. <laughs> yeah, that was a new one I was just thinking It's easy to have a little to choose from. I mean, that's all. Hmm. Well, this is one that, well, Daniel Wilson is not on the CD then. No, this one's not on the CD. But as you know, it'll be on our next one. <laughs> Sound like an ending. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, sort of. Like one of our endings, <laughs> <laughs> this is off the CD called The Big Door. We sure did. I told you. I told you. Chris won. Yes. <laughs> Do we have any more of those to give away later? Yeah. Well, we keep listening, money. folks. We'll have another trivia question in a little bit. Some 
Phil. Hey, Phil. Phil's come down again. <laughs> Phil Lee and I'm helping out tonight here in the studio. My, my forgiving assistant. <laughs> hey, you guys have any kind of mailing list? Nope. Nope. Um. Well, <laughs> well, you know what? Actually, I think each of us individually keeps their own. Oh, we have and our every own. once in a while, uh -huh. each of us will do their own little. So you just have there. to send your things to me, and I will pass the information along. What were those gigs again at downtime again? You got uh, one on the thirteenth. It's the night of Friday the thirteenth, except it's mm -hmm. one a.m. Yeah. Well, okay, the fourteenth then. Which is cool, then. Mm -hmm. And June eleventh. The drummer. Because they both at downtime at 251 West 30th Street between 7th and 8th Avenues in Manhattan. Very nice. <laughs> that was good, right? That was great. She's been All right, now this new one, this next one I mean we're going to do is we filmed a video for uh, in January on a rooftop. <laughs> Wasn't it that was a little the cold? coldest day of the year. But we only filmed it in January <laughs> as a test of our wills because we planned not to edit it for quite a while. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> Irene, you wouldn't believe how cold it was. I it. would believe it because I did one t uh, a year ago in January myself. Oh, you On did. On the second of January, underneath the Brooklyn Bridge. Oh, oh good. Manhattan, right the Manhattan water, Bridge. Pardon me, Manhattan Bridge. Right, well, that's where we were. Right? I froze right to death. Right. And the cold wind whips above. It the, was. Um, well, there was no water. It was just a sheet of ice. Uh, yeah. Yes. Sick. So I am the. Well, it was the Hudson, so it's not water anyway. <laughs> Oh no, it's getting better. <laughs> <laughs> that's not the Hudson, that's the East River. No, where we were, the oh. Hudson. 
Okay. We were on the west West Twenty Third Street and Twelfth Avenue. Okay. That is the Hudson River. I thought I'm I heard right you here. say <laughs> under the bridge. Okay, never mind. Uh, that's correct. Johnny knows that's where he bathes. <laughs> <laughs> it's called a certain girl in my <laughs> perfect world. About bud men. <laughs> we all have them as friends. Nelson? We all hate them. <laughs> Nelson rears his ugly head. Bud men. <laughs> I had you guys. Hey, hey Mike. <laughs>
you. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. Chicken. The lead off track. What is that? Can we give another away another CD, by me? Why, sure. But you know, it might help. No one wants to buy them. Can somebody run in real quick and Find relay the answer, the answer before I start asking the question? That way, while you're playing, I can tell if the answer no. is correct. Okay. Oh, well, this is like another little The wonderful Phil Levy is coming in to ask the question. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I'm keeping Phil running tonight. To All right, now he has the answer. Okay, the second trivia question of the evening is on the old what Batman is? TV series. <laughs> Who played False Face? There are two answers to this False question. Face. I want the actor's name. I don't want the cheap answer, which was himself. No. I want the actor's name. And for False. that, you win a CD. A CD. And a John Johnny's invitation. underwear. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't wearing anything. Ooh. Uh, and an invitation to our record release party at a secret location that I can't tell you about unless you really ask. Oh, do I get invited? You well, can, yeah, you yeah. can definitely come. Yeah. Everyone in the room. Aww. Even you, Phil. <laughs> Especially Phil. Especially but only Phil. if he walks around in that half crouch like he's been walking around in here like Groucho <laughs> all night. <laughs> Cryptic Soup on WFMU. <laughs> Jesus. He this is called gone. chicken.
a black man shot down Just a white cop's point of view Oh, baby. <laughs> the long extended version. Wow. Psych out version of chicken. Cryptic soup. Playing live here on WFMU. Hey, you know, nobody got that trivia question. Nobody even called. Wow. Maybe it's too difficult. Ed, you're making these questions too hard for people. No, that's not true. Baseball trivia quiz. Now there's uh, a yes, who, uh, hey sports fans. Sports fans? 
Listen up. This, this is even older than me. <laughs> well, we have to get the answers, Phil. Who's the number one oh, yeah, Phil, Phil, you gotta come in here. They need uh, you. I gotta give you an answer. Phil's <laughs> gonna know this. He has to. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Phil is walking into the other room to get the question. We'll, uh, okay, um, this trivia question is uh, for real diehard baseball fans. Way back when they were even stupid. <laughs> now, even I wouldn't call baseball they are now. fans stupid. Uh, who was the number one pitcher for the Kansas City Monarchs in 1929? He was a 19-year-old pitcher. This came up, the Kansas City Monarchs. And I even recognize the name, and I'm not a big uh, The Kansas baseball. City Monarchs were a, a old Negro League team, which would have kicked the crap out of any old, new, real baseball club so far. <laughs> so, who is the number one pitcher? He was 19 when he came up, and he threw hard. I know. And and <laughs> what is Johnny's weight sopping wet? Say <laughs> it again. <laughs> All right, let's do another one. Can we do one now? We yeah, we one actually more. got room for about two more, possibly. Uh oh, we got one. Definitely <laughs> one. Well, now we got ten. Ten? Sure you do. All right, we've got. I have one more in me. We have ten more songs. Though. <laughs> okay. It happens. That was false face, I thought that was a good one. No, no, false face. Close my eyes, quench my breath. Dreams of boredom or of death.
Big Soup, playing live here on WFMU. Sure you don't, you couldn't squeak one more out? Um, yeah, you know, that's a nice song. That's a nice dreamy song to end with. And of course, we didn't get another caller for this trivia question. They didn't know it? Nobody, nobody called. Nobody oh, even man. dared to I'll give him the catch his name. Well. Josh Gibson. <laughs> First one who calls in and says Josh Gibson wins the CD. There That's you go. That's not his name. That's his catch's name. Well, first person to call in and say Josh Gibson wins. <laughs> call in and say it was the pitcher who threw to Josh Gibson. <laughs> then you win. I don't know. I think Larry Brown was. Hello. <laughs> well, let's hear one last thing from Cryptic Soup. Okay. Uh, we're gonna do this. Oh, that's right. We can't, can't do that curse one. That song. <laughs> we can't do that song. Hey, can't you just say shite? That's a different word, isn't it? I can. I'll do a different word. Fine. Shoot. I'll do it. I'll Shoot. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like we know our material, Irene. Come on. All right. And Phil again. Phil, we're going to give you a Phil. silver star for tonight. Okay, Phil is now coming into the studio. Phil. <laughs> uh, give it to the drummer. Give the drummer some. <laughs> give the drummer some. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is going to be loose. <laughs> Don't tell it. What's he doing? Oh, jeez. This is going to be real loose. Yeah, it'll be great. Come on. <laughs> 